Hello! This tutorial video will show you how to record your webinar with any meeting. When you record a meeting, only things that an attendee would see or hear will be recorded. For example, the video and audio will be recorded, but not private text chat. Once you're done, the recording will be available on demand through its own unique URL from your account manager. So once you're ready to start recording, you're going to want to press the record button shown here and then press start recording. Now, everything that an attendee would see or hear is being recorded. If you are broadcasting using your computer mic, then we can start broadcasting at any time. However, if you have selected the conference call feature for audio, then it is very important that before we ever start recording that you actually dial into the conference call first. If you don't, then you will see a message telling you that the recording could not be started because no one was currently on the conference call yet. During the recording, we can even stop and resume recording if we are broadcasting using our computer mic and speakers. You just click the same recording button to stop. Once you start again, we will be able to either resume right from where we stopped or start over. Conference call users, however, must record straight through. When we're done recording, we can press the End Session button to shut down the entire meeting and end the recording, or press the Recording button again and press Stop Recording if you have more things to do in the meeting. After the meeting is over, all recordings are available in the Recordings tab. The Audience Login URL will direct viewers to watch the recording online. The Edit Settings button will take us to a screen with a few things we can change. A static password can be set for the recording. You can also just require people to log in to watch the recording so you will have their name and email address. We can get to the details page for this recording the same as any other meeting via the details link. From here, just like any other meeting, we can access the recording links and invite people through our invite system. Congratulations! You now know all about recording your webinars with any meeting.